other news, why was a Preston to London megabus stopped by the police on the motorway this week? Just it's, the usual this reasons. Was, yeah. this, was <laughs> this was the story where a passenger reported seeing some smoke coming out of some mm. other passenger's bag, thought it was a bomb, turned out it was a fake cigarette that was producing water vapour. Now, let's face it, if you've been pulled over, loads of police have arrived, you've got guns in your face, you're being accused of being a terrorist. That's not going to help you give up smoking, is it? <laughs> they shut the M6, 17 police cars and riot vans, 13 fire engines, four ambulances and an army bomb disposal truck attended the, the incident. They walked the people off with their heads in their hands, was like, you know, and made them sit in the middle of the road. Those people on the megabus, that's not the first bad trip they've been on. <laughs> <laughs> When they were sat on the side of the road, you could see some of them going, this is the most luxurious part of the journey so far. <laughs> I'm always really freaked out by Megabus. I mean, do you, are you, do not, it's not the, well, the weirdest thing in the world, the Megabus. Nothing against the bus service itself, but when you drive, like you drive a lot of time on the motorway going to gigs, like, the back of the Megabus, when you're driving along, like, whatever, for those of you who haven't had the pleasure, mm -hmm. that's, that, you could, there's times you just get hypnotised by that weird... <laughs> there are many things I've observed. Firstly, why does that man have such large breasts? Yes. <laughs> Staring at that man's breast, going, that is, that is the same. What kind of. Where can you go for one pound? I, I thought you'd have to come to Megabus. There's, there's you, an address I there. I'd have to put plus a 50p booking fee as if people are going to go, well, that's a rip off. <laughs> <laughs> I, I walked in here with this in my hand, <laughs> expecting to be transported to a faraway land. <laughs> then I find you want more money off you. <laughs> Screw you, Megabus man. What a <laughs> yellow man with enormous bazongas <laughs> looks disappointed behind the counter. Oh! <laughs> that is very I apologise. I apologise. I know that when you're disappointed, you don't go, I am disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> well, Megabus represents the top of the list of the decadence of the West, is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We will bring the West to its knees. Middle aged women from the North will no longer be able to go to matinees at the West End. <laughs> shall not visit their girlfriends in faraway towns. <laughs> Do you think when they were dragged off the bus and they were all sort of sat around it, they were still close enough to the bus to be able to use the free Wi-Fi? <laughs> <laughs> They email the photographs of their own terror alert. The only really irritating about this for the entire... In my ear, constantly, people are going, wear the hat, wear the hat, wear the hat, wear the hat. <laughs> because, yeah, they gave me a yellow hat because they think I look like the <laughs> Megamus guy. <laughs> means that that man looks like a, a penis sausage. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens. <laughs> they should call it penissausage.com. Oh, something yeah. else is already called You're just penis. bringing this up to try and make everybody forget that you look like a penis sausage. <laughs> That's exactly what's going on here. You just look happened. like a penis sausage in a yellow hat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! Ownership of the joke now. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's to somebody got else. another new Twitter <laughs> avatar. <laughs> the, uh, okay, Grant, at the end of that round, although I should get the points myself for the, for the assault to my dignity. Ladies, at the end of that round, the points go to Chris Hewitt Milton! <laughs>